Good afternoon, welcome to the walkthrough of this beautiful Parker 2820 XLD Sport Cabin. This XLD Sport Cabin is the biggest in Parker's inventory right now. Uh, this has a hull length of 28 feet, overall length oh, just over 33 feet with pulpit to end of engines, you know, with the bracket. Um, this particular boat we did bring in with gray gel coat as you can see on the hull sides. Coming down the side of the boat, once you get past the cabin, you can see how immense the uh, cockpit space is on this boat. This is an excellent boat for offshore fishing. If you want to go out for tuna, you want to go out for bass, blues, or bigger fish, ground fish, it'll do it all. It's got a 21 degree dead rise, so going offshore is not an issue in this boat. It's very comfortable. Here at the stern, you can see that we have uh, the engine bracket with twin 300 Yamaha 4.2 liter engines, the V6s, four stroke of course. And then uh, to the left you can see the trim tabs poking out there, underwater lights on this model. Uh, you can see on the starboard side that there is a ladder up underneath the uh, engine bracket. Here's a good shot of the stern door. The stern door was installed on these boats about four to five years ago makes a big difference on this boat uh, you can get in and out and then they also by doing this they put a fish box and a live well which this boat never did never had along with the 25s and the 23s climbing the ladder sorry about the uh, movement but uh, here's a good shot of the cockpit and you can see how immense it is there is a stern seat uh, fold in, fold out type stern seat. It's great for family if you want to take them out or getting out to the fishing grounds. The crew can sit uh, in the stern seat. And we get up here. So let's move inside the uh, cockpit and we're going to move forward and we're going to take a look at the second station. Typically on this boat uh, we do bring in the second station. Uh, this, this boat of course has twin engines so it's going to have the uh, digital throttle and shift. You can see the steering wheel. You can start and stop the engines from out here. It's a great place to do your fishing. You don't have to run inside the cabin. And as we move, you can see this got the hardback um, part of the cabin. You've got that door that's latched open. Peeking inside, you can see the galley cabinet and then the jump seat on the starboard side. If you don't get the galley cabinet, there would be another jump seat on the port side. Here's a good shot of the dashboard with the Garmin 12 inch GPS sounder and you've got your switches, you've got your uh, Yamaha digital gauge, here's a good shot of the VHF radio in the overhead. Uh, they, they really lay out the electronics well. Uh, we did bring this boat in also with the uh, suspension uh, uh, pedestal so it gives a cushier ride for the driver. And here's a good shot of the inner cabin with marine toilet. If you're interested in this boat, contact us here at Salisbury at Riverfront Marine.